Options 38 is a terrific program that um, allows students who don't necessarily um, seek or want a traditional approach to education to do it differently. So it allows more academic freedom and I think it meets the needs of kids that um, don't want to do a traditional approach. That's the whole point. That's why it was called Options, because it's an option. It's your first year in high school, and at every turn you take, there's another wall of work or something else just standing in the way of you doing well. One of the pieces that made it unique is that students had to apply. So most programs, kids just get, quote, placed, right? Oh, you're not going to school, you go here. And options is different in that you have to want to be there. You have to be invested in it at some level. And so we developed interview questions and an application process. And I think I learned some of the coolest stuff through that process about kids. You know, asking questions like, when was the last time you felt successful in school? And most kids would say fourth grade. And here they are in 10th or 11th. That's kind of sad that we've put you in this educational environment and you didn't feel successful for years. In the beginning there was a lot of um, concern by community members that we don't need an alternative program so we never used the word alternative because it wasn't viewed positively. Um, the name came about because it's an option to the traditional and anytime I would stand up in public and talk about it, anytime we would do community meetings, um, I've even presented at Kiwanis and a variety of other places about it, um, was to educate people that alternative isn't bad, but we couldn't even use that word in the beginning. And now, you know, five years later you could, and now you can use that word, but um, it was just an interesting stigma to try and overcome for our community. Well, those kids, those kids, they're our kids. Everybody deserves a choice in how they pursue education. You know, the first year was a little bit crazy. The, we, had, we had come up with a really nice program on paper, but as soon as you try to do something in a classroom with kids, you realize that you have to change things around and you have to modify. Um, so I think the, the first year, uh, you know, the common analogy is building an airplane while you're flying it. We were doing a lot of building the airplane while we were flying it during that first year. How'd you sound? Sound is rolling. So this is options to make documentary. What do you think the outside world thinks about our program? Well, from what people have said, they think we just do finger painting and take naps. <laughs> That's what I've had multiple people tell me that all of you do drugs, all of you are stupid, blah, 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 but it's obviously not true. So. We know it's not true, and that's like yeah. the only thing that matters. I, I, think, I think that we have students here that every year we put 200 pieces of art in this room, and we have hundreds of people come to look at the artwork that you've done all year long. Uh, we know that we have varsity athletes. We have a varsity coach. We have um, musicians. So it's a it's a heck of an opportunity, I think. Without options, I probably wouldn't have graduated high school. Um, I don't know. It's a huge help, and I definitely would recommend it to anybody who would want to join it. Definitely for my path and my career choices, because it like I could work extra. And it also gave me a huge advantage in, of course, the education sense. Um, options actually gave me an opportunity to go through AVP, which is like a huge help for college, and it pays for everything for at least the first couple of years, you know. And I've been wanting to do culinary, and before this, I didn't even think I was going to graduate or go to college or anything, but now here I am sitting steady in college maybe go and do a four-year school or something. I thought it was a place for kids to, who didn't care about their education. For, from what kids would say about options, that it was basically just finger painting classes and that that is definitely not true. The kids in options are great kids and we do take regular classes.
just full speed here. And we need something to serve the serving spoon for. I got it. Austin's is definitely a very okay. family oriented program because we all have the same classes right. together every day, so you really get to know each other. Did we, did we have any signs of any of our guests out there? We're all like one big family. We, everyone just comes together and helps with problems. We all hang out outside of school, and it's just a very fun and loving environment. The best thing about options is the teachers because they're also part of our family and they really care about their students.